What's going on Sumo Links? Today, I'm gonna to be putting some AppSumo tools to the test. You already know I'm Jay from AppSumo and we're the leading digital marketplace for entrepreneurs. And we put out killer tools to level up your business almost daily. This video series is all about diving into some of your favorite tools of the moment and finding out for ourselves just how good they really are. Hopefully by watching me, just an everyday guy, go through some of these tools, you can see just how intuitive they really are and how helpful they can be to growing your business. Let me know in the comments what AppSumo tool you've been loving lately. And without further ado, let's get into our first tool of the day. First up, we're gonna be diving into Vanjaro. Now this is a website builder that has everything for launching, managing, and growing your web presence. So let's get into Vanjaro and see what it's all about. Okay, so here we are on the Vanjaro homepage. It's gonna start by showing you your dashboard. Uh, this is gonna show you where the sites that you are making appear. Uh, it's also gonna show you your billing information, um, your licensing and things like that. So basically we wanna think of Vanjaro as a simple website builder. And let's get started and see just how simple it can be. So we can either order a website or create one. Let's create one from scratch. I'm gonna hit create a new site and I'm gonna hit select a design. Very similar interface to Squarespace right off the bat. Um, you can see there's different templates that they already have loaded up. Depending on what your business is, you can use one of these. And I'm gonna check out Zeal. Okay, so here we are, welcome to your site. Now we're gonna have a title and description. I'm actually making a site that's dedicated to only fans. Now I know what that sounds like, but what I'm talking about here is literal fans. Now I don't wanna get in trouble with copyright infringements or anything, so I'm thinking, Nothing but fans. Our brand is dedicated to bringing you high quality air experiences. Now here's where we start building the website in a really simple, intuitive manner. So right away you see your website's here and then this side panel is gonna show you all of your editing features. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add my own image. So you go here simple drag and drop right here. Okay, let's search online for an image. Fan, Pixabay, shout out. Dun, 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 dun. Ooh, I like that. All right, so we're gonna grab this. It's gonna take this image from Pixabay and boom, just like that, we have an image. The first website dedicated to fans and only fans. So we're just building out a simple homepage here just to show you the capabilities. Okay, we're gonna add a heading, nothing but fans. And we're gonna change that. We have all these different options. Okay, we could also center it like this. I like that. Um, different styles. Let's go with that, I like that. Okay, so we have a basic homepage here. Now I just wanna go through some of the blocks that you can use. Um, you access that by this block button. Uh, and you can see you can add sections, grids, heading text, buttons, different icons. Um, so there's plenty of things that you can add. If you wanted to drag an icon here, let's see what that would do. And let's see if there happens to be a fan icon. That'd be pretty cool. Boom, coming in clutch. Change that to white and I'm gonna center that. Okay. Bottom line, I think Vanjaro is a great website builder. It's affordable. It's just as intuitive and has just as many capabilities as a bigger website like Squarespace. I would not hesitate if I was building out a website like nothing but fans to hop on Vanjaro and with a little bit of learning and watching some tutorials, uh, figuring out everything I need to build a website that is functional and looks really good. So that's a vote for Vanjaro for me. So very cool and I love Vanjaro for that reason. Next up, we're gonna take a look at VidPopUp. Now this is a platform that allows you to build high converting video funnels for your website or your social media. Let's see what VidPopUp has to offer. Okay, so right away we come to the VidPop platform and you will see a very nice clean user interface right here. It starts with the home, which has your statistics, your video plays, replies, your total VidPops, and your average view rate. I don't have any videos yet, so that's why you're seeing goose eggs across the board. Basically what VidPops is, is it's a way to make custom videos that you can then use in a funnel. Whether that is driving people to your email subscription list, whether it's a call to action for buying a product, this is a great tool to integrate video into your marketing strategy. 
So as you can see in vid pop-ups, we can use a ready-made template or we can start from scratch. Let's check out these ready-made templates just to see what's going on here. So let's check out, for instance, this welcome video template. Now we can preview it right here. Hi, welcome to our website. How can I help you today? Now this is cool. So this is the whole point of vid pop-up is you are not just having potential customers or audience members or whoever's viewing your videos on your website, social media, etc., just watching a video. These are interactive. So you can see this video pops up. The guy asks, how can I help you today? Now you can answer in audio, video, or text. So if we said text, you could say, what services do you offer? Question mark, and you can hit submit. Now this is where they ask you for your information, and this is a great example of how you can get someone into your email funnel or get them more information. Okay, so let's say we wanted to choose one of these. For instance, let's just go with the welcome video template. So we choose this. Now this is where it gets fully customizable. You can use an AI spokesperson, that's coming soon. You can record your own video, you can record your screen, you can upload, or you can use stock video. So let's just say if we wanted to look at stock video, they have things like Pixabay, Pexels, Giphy, all sorts of stuff like that. Let's just use a Giphy really quickly, just for use case. So you click on the Giphy, you put it there, thank you, that's great. You also have features like fitting the video or not, so you can play around with positioning. The text size, you can do that as well. Something like, we welcome your feedback. We can change this text size to, let's say, small. We can also change the positioning. Top corner, top right, top left, all of that, bottom, things like that. Uh, we can change the text color as well to anything we want. So let's say we want it to be red. This is very crude right now, as you can see, but with a little bit of effort, you can make this video really stand out. That's just one example. Now let's say we want to go back uh, to the answer. So you can answer with different things, multimedia, multiple choice. So if you wanted to do a multiple choice answer in this video, you can show the option count and you can add a choice. Choice one, which you can put here. Are you satisfied? Okay, you can add another choice. Are you unsatisfied? Okay, so you can have those two options right there. And then based on what they click, you can put them into a funnel. So this is where it's really cool. So if a jump to, and that's where you can have the end screen or you can have something else. If B, jump to. So I think vid pop-up is a very cool tool if you are trying to incorporate video into your marketing funnels. You can use things like multiple choice, you can use call to action buttons, you can have people who watch the video interact with it by recording a video and sending it back. That's great if it's a customer service video and you're asking for feedback. But the bottom line is vid pop, very cool, I dig it and I wanna use this more in my own business. And last but not least, we're gonna dive into Event Titans. Now this is a single platform that lets you put up a white labeled event website, sell tickets, and manage the actual event experience with ease. So if you're interested in live events, getting more customers and building a community, I think Event Titans is gonna have something cool to offer. Let's check it out. Okay, right away we come to the Event Titans dashboard. Very clean UI, not too much going on. Nothing crazy, especially for something that is a pretty involved process. Here's where you can get started. You can create an event, you can create a survey, or you can create evaluator. So let's start by creating an event. Okay, so the first thing that pops up is your event details. So you can put your event name, nothing but fans grand virtual event. Is this public or private? So we can customize it. I'm gonna make this a private event. And is it an online event, an offline, or a hybrid? This is really cool if you want to have uh, a hybrid event going or if you want to just keep it online. Let's do that. Event category. We're going to call this, it's a fun fair, but it's also a business. And it's kind of a camping trip. For now, we'll just say it's business. Now, this is a really cool part of Event Titans. So you can have a single page, regular 2D, 
or you could have a virtual 3D lobby. Basically, this is gonna have a 3D lobby where guests can come, get ready for your event, interact with other guests, things like that. Now, here's where we get into the nitty gritty. Uh, you're gonna have all sorts of options here. So you're gonna have the about the event, the agenda, the exhibitor, you can have challenges, sponsors, speakers, and network. You can have all this amazing stuff. And you can see this is where the homepage is. Nothing but fans, grand virtual event, a register button if needed. Um, you can have tracking pixels for Google Pixel, uh, coupons, um, tags for the event, a photo booth, you can add photos, you can do all sorts of crazy stuff like that. And if we hit next, this is where you add the ticket name, and this is where you can have pictures of your ticket, available quantity. You can customize the tickets however you want. So as you can see, the ticket section is so customizable. You can make the tickets for your event as much and as comprehensive as you need. Uh, you can see all the different ticket types. Uh, you can have raffles, general donations, things like that. Uh, and you can have a seating picture as well. So there's tons to do there. And you can get even more into this on reports, which is going to show you everything, the nuts and bolts behind the scenes of your events, the sales from the events, the payments that have been collected, the amount that are owed, that kind of thing. And then if you go into CRM, this is gonna give you a whole contact list of everybody that went to your event. You can further segment that, people who had signed up but didn't attend, people who attended, and you can export these contacts to Salesforce and have immediate lead generation going. So Event Titans takes you from creating an event all the way to generating new business from that event. It's a really intuitive platform. It doesn't take long to build out a stellar event and I highly recommend it for anybody who's hosting webinars or live events or trying to generate more business through an event-esque process. So there you have it folks, Van Jaro, Vid Popup, and Event Titans. Three great tools to help your business grow even more. Don't forget all of these tools and more can be found on appsumo.com. And let us know down below what tools you've been using from the store lately and which ones you're loving. Make sure you're subscribed to both of our YouTube channels so you never miss out on killer deals coming through the store. As always, we'll catch you on the next one.